When you think about slavery, you be thinking about the Southern institution. Well, did you know that New York City was the biggest opponent against the new constitution? Slave meant more to the Northerners than the South. Makes you wonder how much of our history is full of doubt. New York stretched out their slavery far past the Emancipation Proclamation. It was only found out through an in-depth investigation. Did you know that New York slave fought with the British that made the Native Americans a bit skittish? The Native American in New York attacked the settlers to free the slave, using no matter bubble between themselves and the settlers, hoping they will be aid. To keep the slave institution alive in the South, Northern bankers financed Southern endeavors, hoping to keep this out of the history books forever. Slavery was seen more about the profit than being inhumane. Africans were seen as animals, and the rebellious ones were seen as insane. They couldn't see Africans as human because they knew what they were doing was wrong. Seeing them as they pet helped keep the slavery institution strong. Did you know that there were more than 10,000 slaves in New York City alone in the 19th century? The institution would have not gone away without the effort of the abolitionists, but was never told in our history. As we know that politics follow economics, it's not surprising that New York politicians were beholden to their southern counterpart. But for outer appearance, they must have the slave in their heart. The area around Washington Square was once called the land of the black. The Dutch slave owners were always under attack. The Native American needed the black as a buffer between themselves and the white, gave the free slave land with all ownership rights. Because of geography and tight living quarters, slaves didn't live with their masters, but they did have their own living borders. Slaves were paid a salary to afford their own home. With that kind of arrangement, the slave felt free and felt left alone. I could keep going on about the Northern Slave, but the back still remain the same. The North still hold the record on unmarked grave.